Look at this. Wide open powder field. Who? <laughs> Gosh dang, I don't know where I am. Gosh dang it, McCluskey, we lost. I tell you, we lost. We lost. Whew. Whew. Like I did, I'm walking straight up, vertical, knee deep. At least I get untouched trees. mile and a half to government camp so there's no parking not no riding so uh haha -ha, yeah you guys ever been uh, snowboarding in the streets probably not good for my base <laughs> Go out of bounds. This may be one of my last days to do this because I don't have snow tires. Hopefully, there's not too much ice. We got a cascade concrete. Weird powder. Kind of ride on top of it. snow though feels like the snow that you ride like after some rain yep there's the ice Actually, this is not the area I usually ride. <laughs> this is like a hidden bone zone. <laughs>
creek. Gosh dang, I don't know where I am. I don't know if you guys can see, but I'm all the way over here. So it looks like I'm gonna have to go up and hike over those trees. Gosh dang it, Mikulski, we lost. I tell you, we lost. We lost! Whew. Whew. The idea is that I'm walking straight up, vertical, knee deep. Gosh dang, out of breath. I'll update you guys later. Oh, looks like a long hike, so maybe I can ride it out. Uh, at least I get untouched trees.
Yeah, so I'm like so far out of bounds. I can't even get back to Timberline. So I have to ride all the way to government camp and then probably take a shuttle. Second sign to government camp. Hopefully there's no more tight trees and it's just this, another sign. Okay. okay a tree with arrows. Gosh dang, it's really wet, grippy snow. mile and a half to government camp Whew. Well, I guess I can finally say I've done the glade trail As you go down the mountain, obviously. So the snow here isn't really powder. It's uh, it's that spring slushy powder. I have a hyper smooth on, so you can't really tell that it's super bumpy. But my legs are chattering like crazy Ugh. I mean it's kind of pretty um I think they groom it sometimes I don't know because if they do this would actually be like a really nice uh trail to just kind of haul it and go really fast and just full send through the trees yeah. Definitely some some grippy and chattery snow. Well, there's ski bowl up ahead. I didn't get to ride there this year or last year. They do have uh, Wild Mike's Wednesdays. So Wild Mike's Crazy Pizza, I'm sure you've seen them in the frozen section of stores. They're from Oregon. So if you get a frozen pizza in the winter, they give you a little coupon where you get $10 off on any Wednesday day of night riding. And it's the largest night riding area in all of America. Personally, I don't really like the night riding part. I like to go when they open at three or four and get fresh powder tracks because it is a lot steeper than Timberline. Woo. Gosh dang, this snow is killing my legs. Oh, I feel like I'm fighting it. It's like break, then go break then go and I haven't waxed since before my February ski trip uh, at the end of January and well it's gonna be April next week so that should tell you that I am in need for a wax That's confusing. I guess they both go to government camp. I think 
think one of them though goes to uh summit ski area which is actually a pretty nice resort so hopefully this will spit me out there yikes oh these the brakes are really hitting Oof. Uh oh what is this drop into the parking lot. Let's do it. <laughs> so it's no parking, not no riding, so uh haha, -ha, yeah. Here you guys ever been uh, snowboarding in the streets? Probably not good for my base. <laughs> yep. Uh, I guess we're uh, walking into town. Da da da. Da 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 da. Interesting. Didn't know there were houses back here. Well, see you guys in the next video. Here's your update guys. I'm walking on the side of the freaking road in government camp trying to find the shuttle stop so I can get back up and get to my car.